Hey everybody, we're gonna look at one thing today and that is changing the default channel strip so that when you click down here to create a new channel or a new track, that it doesn't just show up with whatever your default is. You can change what shows up there. So I'm going to delete that one for a moment. What we need to do is create or choose in our library the channel strip that we want to come up as the default. So for instance, if we have this after party here, we can control click and have it be defined as the default. That means now, when I double click out here, that's the one that's gonna show up. Well, what I want is an empty channel strip. And so what I'm gonna do is come through to a blank one like this that has nothing on it, go to the settings, and I'm going to save channel strip setting as, and you can see I've already saved it as empty. You can look here if you want to see where these are stored. If you want to delete them or go in there and, and find them under your home user, music, audio, music, apps, channel strip, settings, instrument. So give it a name for whatever you want. I already have one called empty and it looks just like this. Right here, empty. Now I can control click on this, define as default. And anytime I want, I can just double click and it's gonna bring an empty instrument track. You can change that to any of the other ones that you want. If you're always bringing up a piano, for instance, or if you always want a certain synthesizer or bass or whatever, I just prefer to have an empty thing there so that I can use whatever I want, add a new instrument, all of that. So it's really handy in this case to be able to just add that emptiness. Hope you enjoyed this and I hope you're having a great weekend. I will see you next week.